everybody it's Pam with Silver and Sparkles and I haven't really done um, unboxing videos but I did want to show you guys what I got in the mail um, I was approached by Maggie Retro um, boutiques they make these fabulous paper dolls um, and I posted a few things about them recently um, their kits and how much fun I'm having working with them. Um, if you can't tell, I'm really into these that look like veggies. And um, I'm going to be making a whole uh, journal, probably fall Halloween y themed because they're kind of um, super fun and movable and all of those things, but also, you know. A little a little creepy in a good way so there you go um so these are gonna end up on some pages and some journals but um if you go to the website you have options of just doing the PDF files of different kits that they have um, or you can order the kit to be shipped to you and I believe um so when you do that you get the PDF file too and you get a package in the mail. And I'm going to show you what comes if you get the one in the mail. Um, this awesome Mr. Moon, or I'm not quite sure what their name is, um, is free. If you go to their website and you just, you know, it says sign up, but it's basically for their emails and things. And then you can download this fella. And that is a good way to see if this is something you like doing or if you like their products. So he's pretty tall. And I printed all of these just straight the way the PDF was. I'm assuming, you know, we could make them a little smaller. Um, the carrot guy, I used tinier brads to put him together just because he was a little bit smaller just the way he came. Um, he's just a petite fellow. Um, but anyway, super cute. So let me show you. They also have some animals. And I picked this cat and this dachshund here. And I haven't cut these out and put them together yet, but how cute are they? And I think I'll use the tiny brads for this one as well. But let's see what happens if you decide to order the kit um, and have it shipped to you. So I did already look and peek inside, but but let's, let's do it together. So um, it came from Germany, didn't take too long. And then let's see, um, here are the dolls and the ones that I picked out. It's, um, you know I'm going to reuse this paper, right? I love some tissue paper, and this is that pretty um, brassy gold color. And the little um, stamp sticker they close it with is really cute, too. <laughs> All right, so let's see what we got. We have um, President Lincoln. How cute. I can't wait to put him together. Uh, George Washington. And then, of course, I had to get a few more veggies. So I have Potato Tim to go with my veggie people. Um, Goldie Corn and Radishell. Uh, she's so cute. And I love the pink, the pink colors. Let's see real quick. Um, so these are already, obviously, you don't have to print or cut them out. So that that's a plus, right? I don't want to lose any of the little pieces. Um, there, I wouldn't even say it's glossy, but it's very smooth. Um, and the holes are already punched. Some of them just aren't all the way through, but that's okay. Let's see. I think she goes like that, right? And then that'll be her little body. And we'll have to get her arms and legs on her. Oh my gosh, how cute. So they print really nicely, but the, these are... Um, a good option if you don't want to have to do all that fussy cutting or you don't have a printer or things. I do like that they also, if you pay for the kit, um, they give you those PDF files, so that's nice. All right, so let's put Radishell away. Um, I really like it. I like the colors. You can see on Goldie Corn that yellow is pretty. All right, and then this also came in the package, and you can probably guess what this is. This is the hardware you need. So it's just um, brads, and they did um, put in some Velcro dots, which I didn't think about that when I attached these fellows to um, uh, these cards, because I'm gonna put them in a journal. I just glued a portion of the torso down, and you guys know I love a good Velcro dot, right? And um, 
what that would have been a much better solution because then I could take the doll off and play with it separate from being on the card. So um, I imagine that's going to be happening soon. But anyway, it looks like they send you everything you need to put your um, dolls together. The website has instructions and all kinds of information actually about paper dolls in general and the evolution. So that's kind of cool. Um, I did, so on the Little Moon Guy, I, I poked some holes in him and gave him some ribbon, a ribbon bow and some ribbon hair, a little bow there, a butterfly um, on his shirt. He's very sassy. Um, love him. And then on Mr. Broccolini, I think this one's named Broccolin, I used my gold paint pen and just gave... Gave him a few little highlights. Same with Tomato Tim. And I don't know if I did anything to Carrot. I think I love Carrot the way she was. But again, I could see some ribbons and all of that being added. So, so many options. So much fun. If you guys are interested, um, if this is on a platform that allows me to put the link, I'll add the link. If not, go to my link tree. Um, like on Instagram that's in my bio and there's a link for you and um, I do get a, a percentage um, if you make a purchase so thank you guys that helps my business a little bit too but um, I just love them and I'm gonna have a lot of fun uh, and with this being in the United States a uh, election year I think I'm gonna have some fun with President Lincoln and um, President George Washington Okay, thanks for watching. I hope you guys like. Um, oh, and let me know, you know, if you guys want a tutorial about how I put these together um, and embellish them and stuff, let me know. I think that might be fun to do together. And if you're interested, uh, leave me a comment. Let me know. Give me a thumbs up. And um, more to come on these awesome paper dolls. Thanks, guys.